Hey, top of the morning, guys. Top of the morning. Well, I, 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 well this morning it's kind of kind of overcast, you know. Yeah, this looks like it's overcast this morning. But I'm on the jet here, so it's kind of dark. I don't know if you can see me properly. But I'm out here very early trying to catch some bait, you know. I'm going on a fishing adventure this morning. I don't know where I'm going to end up, but I just want the bait first to keep, you know. And that would be good enough for me to decide where I can, I can fish today. But I am. Um, See there guys, see the bait here, you can you see that? Pill chats, right? So there's a lot of bait out here right right now. It's just first I'm coming out here this time and catching so much bait. You know? So just have to make use of it, you understand me? Yeah. Aye, hey, hey, catch one, it must be toughy this key love it's just Alright, come, toughy. Alright, see I'm here going crazy. I'm going crazy, you know man, I tell you. Some morning lighting out now, you know, guys, yeah, and I have a few bait already. Them small selling about, you know, no? I could just use them, you know, because I don't have no other choice. So I could just use them. See them there. Come here, come here, come here, come here, wait, don't come off, don't come off. Right, it's a good, it's a little bigger one. Let's put him in the bucket, see me. No, it's the same size. Okay. All right, 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 right. This is a bigger one. This is like a bang. Hi, it's too. Where is it? It's too big, tough here. This is not. <laughs> Oi, drop off. No, oh, you can't escape the one. No, you can't escape. Bucket, you forgot now. <laughs> you can't escape the one here at all, brother. Put bucket him. I'm going to show you guys something. So the amount of bait that is out here, I'm going to show you something. Uh, Joe, let me catch up, catch up this one. Let me take up this one. Take up this one. Take up this one. Alright, these two. Eh? So we have two here. So. Alright, let me take up this one. This one, see there. Pale chads. No, no, no. Look out there, so guys. Look at the water right in front of me out there. So. You see that? Look at that. Look how much bait out there. So. <laughs> A whole lot of bait. You know these cameras don't, don't perform well in low light, you know, so you might not see me clearly or see what I'm doing clearly, crystal clear. Because you need a lot of light for these cameras to show properly, you know, to record properly. But at least you can see what is going on, you know, right now. Right now it's just bait. So here we are. So here we are now guys, I got a whole lot of bait, not a whole lot, it's a little after 6 now so I got the baits early, see them there, they're in this bucket, I don't know, you're not going to see them, but see the water bowling up there, see it, yeah, so I have enough bait in there I think, but I need to get out of here early so, I didn't leave anything right, because I love to leave things here so you know, I don't want to leave anything you know, I have a pump on my bucket, I have two, three rods, okay. I don't think I'll leave it anything. So I'm heading out of here guys. Um where should I go to this morning? I think I'm gonna go to Port Royal. Even though the place is overcast. I don't like to fish in the rain. But uh, let us see how it goes now. Let us see how this thing goes. Alright, so catch on the spot. So I just leave the jetty you now guys. Yeah man, just leave the jetty. And I'm, I'm, I'm heading around. Well, I make up my mind to go to Port Royal because I, 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 when, I, when I was on the jetty, I never know where I'm going this morning. But since I get the beach so early, I decided that I'm going around to Port Royal. Right? So that's where I'm heading now, guys. And the target species this morning is snapper. Hopefully, I can catch some snapper this morning because it's kind of early now. Right? So that's where I'm heading now, guys. All right? So if you catch you on the spot, I'll catch you around to Port Royal and reach on there. All right? So stay tuned. All right, so guys, so this is the place. I don't see the weed, so I'm going to start set up my, my sand spike right here. Don't look so bad. 
so I'm going to put on the right here, so. So I just put out that sand spark there, so. You know, I love to set out that he's even one rod before doing anything else. As I said, I want to maximize my chance of catching a fish. So I'm putting up my first bait, guys. See there? Right? Right, 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 right. Oh, don't wake me up so early. Good. So my first bait. Good, so. My first, first bait is out. That's all the right here. This is my Akuma. This is my Akuma Azores, guys. See there? And I load this 150 pound braid and 40 pound leader. Let's put out this one now, right? So out there, right? So that one is out also. This one is out also. Wow, here's a deep one. Wow. It's very deep. So alright guys, so both rods are out now. No. This one, which is the 50 pound braid. Akuma Azores that one over there so which is 15 pound trilene Akuma also Akuma Helix so I'm using two Akuma reels mm. what kind of fish is this? fish on ah yes hold on for fish but it might come easy can I tell me what kind of fish this? come here come here come here come here come here man where are you going? Come up here. Oh, the blue one. Alright. Ah, it's one of them blue runners. Alright, guys, it's just one of them blue runners, one of them small blue runners. See me here? Here, guys, blue runner. Small blue runner jack. Alright. Number one in the ice box. Yeah. Run up on them like them crazy man. Alright, so this is another bit. And I set it out now for a coffee. So I'm looking for my right now. Why? I'm try to see if I can hook up something again before the wolf are you know? Come up. And if I don't hook it up right now, I hook up anything right now, you know. And another half an hour, you know, the whole place full of weed. So. Water here is so not so deep enough, so maybe I won't even catch anything right here. But it's still go up more to the right, but right now, just right here from there, just here because time I run out, you know? Just gonna stay right here, so. Something of this land, something of this land, something of this land. What is it? What is it? What is it? What of this land? See there, something of this land. Don't take long. Yes, fish on. Fish on. What kind of fish is now? Come here. Oh, blue runner. So, 
<sighs> it's another blue runner guys <laughs> I have another blue runner here, see me here I just put him on, just hold him with the lip paper here right here so that you can see him properly alright so it's two two blue runners alright come on, come on, behave yourself take out this oh, lip paper, don't hold him properly alright come on put a splash up the camera screen but see there guys another blue runner uh, little size blue runner but them can't eat you know eat inside so we're searching for food so let's get one more fish on all right guys it's time to leave this place now you know because it's getting windy the wind, is getting, the wind is getting very strong and there's a lot of grass in the water see there and as I tell you before now, this, this weed here, see, see if you have braided line in the water, this weed bungle up around the braided line and not up the braided line. Alright? So I'm going to look at that, look at that. See that? Look right in front of the line right there. That is where the bungle of weed is. Alright? Right bungle up around my braided line. So you know what I'm going to do now? I'm going to pack up and leave this place here. You know, I didn't catch a species that I come around here for, which is a snapper. But I still end up catching two blue runners, which is good, you know, and I'm grateful for that. So I'm gonna take them home now and cook them up, alright? So we catch at home, alright? Alright guys, so these are the two blue runners I caught today. See them there? Two nice blue runners. Alright? So I'm gonna just quick do a thing, do a little thing right now and take them in the kitchen, alright? So let's get started. guys so this is what I have now right right this is all that I want I don't want the head and I don't want the middle bone I just want the meat and this is it see there nice thick meat I take off most of the most of the bloodline out of it right I'm gonna just put the head in the fridge can maybe take that and boil soup or something but I'm gonna take these in the kitchen now right I'm gonna take these in the kitchen and fry them up, alright? So, we catch you in the kitchen. I'm going to season this up now and put it down to the fire, alright? So, let's go. Alright, so, we start with the 
all purpose. Garlic powder now, garlic powder, garlic. Right? So, come yeah, on, all the seasoning rub into the fish. See there? Yeah? So this is Indian style. Captain Seafood man, they say, why are you giving them the Indian style? I say, yeah. Just shake it up in it like that and coat it, you know? And that's it. Alright, so we're going to remove that. Alright peeps, there we are now, that is the fish, blue runner, nice, you see that, come on, nice and pretty, eh? golden brown and everything, but guess what now, mama just give me some rice and a, little, and a slice of pear, see that hot, she just cook it a while ago, and I go around there and see it and say, woman, well, get some of the rice, you know, so mama give me some rice and a slice of pear, so guess look what I got to do now, a poor man did this, you know, <laughs> then I have nothing more in the fridge, so, I got, I got to wrap up something now, poor man, then I look for this now, people. Alright. I hit this now, alright. So, I'm going to take out the fish now. I'm going to piece of the big fish, alright. So, I'm going to take out a piece of the big fish. Alright, hit. Mash up. Oh. So, see it here, guys. That one piece right there, so. And another piece right there, so. So, see here now, guys. I call this the poor man dinner, right? See, many of have a gravy and a sauce, but guess what I'm going to do now? I'm going to do something. Look at this now. I'm going to catch up with the oh, watch out. You see that? See that? See that, guys? So, what do call that? Poor man dinner. Yeah, man, no gravy or nothing, but guess what? The fish is moist and nice, so you don't need no gravy on this. So, guess what? No, I'm going to eat the dinner you now. So, remember, guys, like, share, and subscribe press that notification bell and as always man thanks for watching see you in the next one fish on